The 10 News Weather Authority, always watching and tracking for you from the JES Weather Center. 547 this morning picture of the day coming in from forest and you can see the sunrise lighting up the bottom of the clouds and also the hillsides there. You can send your pictures to us through pin it in order to see them on air. All right, let's get you out the door this morning. Still some slick spots in areas that saw a wintry mix yesterday. Otherwise, it's a cloudy sky, a little bit of fog in Lynchburg and south side as well. That could be causing some problems on the roads too early this morning. But that fog is going to get mixed out by some gusty wind. So if you have uh, lightweight trash cans there, you may want to weigh them down. They could get tipped over because the gusts will be between about 20 and 30 miles per hour on a day like today. It's going to add a little bit of chill to the air, but at least some improvements with regards to temperatures today as compared to yesterday. Highs in the NRV and Highlands, low to mid 40s, Roanoke upper 40s, Lynchburg south side lower 50s after you get rid of some fog. Once the wind calms down overnight, temperatures fall to about 24 to 28 first thing tomorrow. Afternoons are going to trend warmer for us heading into Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. By Thursday, however, we're going to be tracking a storm system that eventually brings some rain to us, it's especially going to be the case late Thursday into Thursday night. On the back end of that, however, the wind shifts direction. You see that connection to the Great Lakes. So we'll be windy and colder with most of our snow targeting the west facing slopes, some of which could actually spill over a little bit. So you see the bulk of accumulation. That's going to be the west facing slopes heading into Friday, but a few snow showers and uh, even sleet showers, if you will, could make it over the mountains heading into Friday. Regardless, going to be windy and colder by then. Windy and cold today, 43 the high in the New River Valley with high highs in the 50s starting tomorrow, Wednesday, and then again Thursday. Rain late Thursday, you may see a few scattered bursts of snow on Friday. High temperatures around 40 degrees will only manage to be in the 30s for highs on Saturday before things improve for us a little bit heading into Sunday afternoon. For the Roanoke Valley, 49 the high today, 52 tomorrow. Notice again, tomorrow morning is going to be cold. But the next several afternoons are going to trend warmer for us, especially Thursday. Despite the fact that we've got some rain coming in later on, we pull the air in out of the south. Your high of about 58 degrees. Temperatures dropping for the most part Friday, and then you'll see the wind picking up as well. Maybe a few sleep pellets out there heading into Friday, but not a big deal. Not a major winter storm by any stretch. It's just going to turn colder heading into the weekend. Saturday, high of about 43. Sunday, your high about 51 degrees.